a TikTok feature that you may not be using that will drastically grow your account. That is the green screen effect. Today we're gonna to walk through what green screen is, why it is so important, and a full tutorial on how to use it on your videos. If we've not already met, hi, my name is Karis, and I create content on all things real estate, social media, and self-development. If you enjoy the video, please give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you never miss a video with me. If you wanna learn how to use the green screen effect on your TikTok, just keep on watching. So before we dive into the tutorial, let's talk about what the green screen effect is. The green screen, it's like when you watch the Weather Channel and the lady is standing in front of this big green screen, but there's nothing actually on there. But on the TV, you see the Weather Channel. It's like that. So how it basically works on TikTok is something very similar. You can put a picture or a video on the green screen and then you can be in the video talking about it or you can be not in the video at all and just show pictures. I'm gonna show you some examples of my TikToks that I did where I'm using these effects so that you can see how to do it on the account. Now, why is green screen important to use? So for one, TikTok likes when you use their features and two, a lot of trends use this green screen effect. So being able to know how to use it is gonna help you when you see a trend and you can quickly know how to pull it up how to add pictures, how to add videos, and you'll be ready to go. Before we dive into my phone, if you are a real estate agent and you're on TikTok and you want tips, tricks, hacks, tutorials, all the above, I will leave a link in the description below for my TikTok for Realtors Facebook group. Join it, it will help you drastically grow and know what you're doing with the app. All right. Let's dive in. So let's walk through how to use the green screen and I'm gonna give you two examples of how I've used them for pictures and for videos. So you go on your plus button here like you regularly would. You're gonna go down the bottom left corner on effects. Now, the green icon, there's two of them. One is gonna be for the pictures and one is gonna be for the videos. So you have to choose the one that has the play button is the video with the arrow pointing up and the one that has the picture with the arrow pointing down, that is the picture one. So if you go on pictures here, for example, I did, you could do the best beaches in South Florida. So these are beaches that are in Fort Lauderdale, Miami, things like that. So in the video, you could hold it here and talk about, hey, this beach is here, blah, blah, blah. Then what you wanna do is you wanna hold it down, talk about it, and then let go, and that is it. Then you go in effects again, choose your next picture, okay. Then this beach is for Lauderdale. It is great, it is pretty, etc. But you know, be better than that. When you're done, you can add text, add music, all that good stuff. For the green screen video, start over. You're gonna go in the video one. It's gonna pop up with your videos. We are gonna pull up my cute nephew. Now obviously, use a video or something that is relevant to your niche. My nephew is waving at me. Do your video, hold it down, talk about it and let go. Now what you can do on the green screen videos and same with the pictures as well, you don't need to be in the picture, you don't need to be in the video. So if you pull your face away and point it at a blank space, see? You don't have to be in it yourself. So you could do it, hold on the button and not be in it the whole time. So it's up to you whether you wanna be in the picture and be talking about it or in the video and be talking about it, or if you just want the pictures and the videos and that is it. So let me show you an example of where I used them on my account. So I did a video, um, the two that come to my head, I did this one, it's um, real estate, I pick my poison and it's you. And I added quick green screen pictures of these luxury houses because I'm a real estate agent and I like luxury houses and that's what I focus on. So that is my poison and that was a trending sound at the time and I added my poison as luxury houses. I used the green screen effect. It was good, did well. An example that I can think of that I used for the green screen video. Here we go, perfect. Great one, talk about Florida's weather because I walked outside and there was spouts, water spouts, or whatever they're called. This video here, I was talking about Florida. I have Florida up there, catch people's attention and there was this crazy, <laughs> like right here. I was scared, I didn't know what to do. But it caught people's attention because 
It had Florida, it had summer weather. I added the green screen video and that was it. So a very easy way that you are able to use the features to add something different in, to give a different level, a different layer, a different component of your video that is simple because you're not even doing a lot of the content yourself, it's already made. All right guys, so that is how to use the green screen effect, pictures and videos on your account. Just a helpful tip here, whether it's the video, whether it's the picture, try and make it as portrait as possible. So you can add in videos, add in pictures that are landscape or square, but it doesn't look as good because you've got the black screen at the top and the black screen at the bottom. If you're using this effect, try and do a portrait video, portrait picture. If you have to have a shorter one, whether it be square or whether it be landscape, add text in the top to make sure you still capture people's attention during it. All right, that is all I have for this video today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, you know the drill. And if you have any other questions, any other TikTok features that you want me to go over, drop them down in the comments below. And make sure you join the Facebook group, TikTok for Real Estate Agents. All right, I will see you in the next one.